remember those days, those L's, I could sleep right now. I get paid, fake games, stay in peace. I breaking the blues over steak, I gotta eat right. You could be my peace sign. I don't need that energy around me. I just need sun, you're so cloudy. I wake up good, you're so grouchy. Please get from around me. Cause I gotta say, you're looking like a gift for me. Wrapped up nice and neat, baby. Get in my way now, don't be shy. We'll be here dancing day and night. Get in my groove now, don't be shy. Cause I got the system, my favorite things. You could be the part where it all begins. You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of it. You could be a one. Baby, I will show you how you can catch my vibe And right away I so much time Looping in the blurry lights Get in my way now, don't be shy We'll be here dancing day and night Get in my groove now, don't be shy Cause I got this list of my favorite things You could be the part where it all begins You could be the first and the second and the third and the rest of That's TJ, and we're going to Judy's house, and I'll see you guys there. Okay. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's your favorite cousin Jess, back on your screen with yet another vlog. Today is Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, you guys! Happy Turkey Day! Merry Turkey Day! Save the turkeys! 
Mary had a little lamb. Whatever you are celebrating today, I hope that everything is in abundance for you, the blessings are raining in, and everything is on the up and up for you and yours. I cooked what I was supposed to cook, macaroni and cheese, yams. I didn't show the mashed potatoes yet because I haven't made those yet. I'm gonna make them when I get to my mom's house just because I feel like mashed potatoes, they need to be cooked in the moment. Like, you can make mashed potatoes right before you're about to eat. And then I made two cakes. So that's what I cooked. That's my contribution to Thanksgiving this year. So comment down below and let me know what you guys cook for Thanksgiving, whether you just, you know, contributed a couple of dishes to the family dinner, whether you cook a full-fledged Thanksgiving dinner. Listen, honey, I don't know about making no turkey. I ain't about to pull all that shittlings and whatever that shit is up that turkey ass. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. So I don't know if I will ever be cooking the turkey, frying the turkey. I don't know if I'm ever gonna do that. But my mom actually fried the turkey. She made the ham. She did the corn pudding. She did the greens and she's doing a gravy. And I bought the biscuits because I bought the biscuits. That's what I do, I buy the biscuits. Normally I go to like Golden Corral or Texas Roadhouse and get biscuits cause y'all know how that honey butter be hitting. But Gia tried my macaroni and cheese for the first time and let the people know what it's hitting for. <laughs> With that macaroni and cheese in for shorty. It was really good. It was cheesy and it had like cheese. You smell like your grandma. That's because I put too many stuff. But yeah, Gia finally tried my macaroni and cheese. I don't know why she be faking. Like, faking. But yeah, no macaroni and cheese is hitting. And I got three crock pots worth of macaroni and cheese. This is the yams, that's macaroni and cheese. That's macaroni and cheese in the white one. And then there's one beside it that's in a black crock pot that's also macaroni and cheese. I came through with the mac and cheese this year. Come through for the mac and cheese if you like it cheesy. Mac and cheese is the shit anytime. Boom. But yes, you guys, that is the vibes for right now. We're supposed to be running this peanut oil to my mama's house so she can fry this turkey. It's 2.30. Normally, we eat around like 3, 3.30, so I think it take a turkey like maybe like an hour-ish, give or take. I like them crispy. I like my turkey extra crispy, and I like dark meat. That white meat of that turkey, it be real dry. That dark meat is where it's at. And then you throw that cranberry sauce on top of that. But your mac and cheese and your yams do not mix them together. Whatever that little meme is running around with the mac and cheese, with the yams baked into, don't do that. Don't do that, like that's nasty. I mean, if they just happen to meet on your plate, that's a different story. But normally we eat on sectionals. What's some plates called? <laughs> we eat on sectionals for Thanksgiving, so I don't know. My food don't have no need to be touching. The mac and cheese do not have to marry the yams. Like, they just in the crock pot beside each other right now. That's it. That's all. But we are going to continue to get it together. I got a few more things to, like, pack in the truck or whatnot. I got to drop one of these crock pots off first. So I'm going to talk to you guys once we get, like, settled and everything at my mom's house so I can just, like, show you the whole spread. So we will talk to you guys then. Guys, I can juggle. Wait. You only got one ball and you're gonna call out a juggle. <laughs> you a scammer.
browns. Yeah, I cut and chopped the potatoes. Those are boiling. I put the rolls in the oven. They're almost done. The turkey about to bring his ass out of that fryer and we're gonna get busy on this mother five trucking food. This is my five trucking hungry. To these greens. I'm gonna like a whole fat bag. Did you make that eggs? No. What's wrong with you? So I gotta go to Birmingham. Tony, you broke your plan. And we will see you guys in our next one. And guys, put a thumbs up, click the button. If not, do not stay tuned. Hey, like that thing, like that thing. The thing is right here, right here, or right on our foreheads. Peace.